lot. It was a great team effort. I couldn't have done without the blocking. The lead blocking was really important, the line blocking. Just everything to set up that drive. It was a lot of habit. I was just giving all I had. You know, there wasn't time left, a lot of time left, so I just kept moving my legs and doing what I could. The way the second half was going, whoever had the ball last was going to have it last before overtime. <laughs> That's how it felt. You know, we had so many mental mistakes on drives that we just kept shooting ourselves in the foot. But that was a hard fought game. I was proud of our kids for being physical, for bouncing back from a tough loss, and leaving out what they did out there tonight. I don't think we played a very good first half. I, I thought we looked a little sluggish, we looked a little slow, and you know, that they're a good football team. And against a good football team, you better play all four quarters, not two of them. And I thought we played a much better second half. And, like the last drive of the first half and the second half, we played better. We played with some emotion. Well, defensively, we did some good things. Offensively, I just really wasn't excited with what we did. But we'll all be at school tomorrow morning at 7.30, and, uh, you know, because we have class, and that's their first prerogative. They're going to be in class, and they're, yes, they're going to be sore. They'll be sore all day, but we'll, we'll monitor what we do this week and make sure we do a lot of more mental work. I don't know how much physical work we're going to be able to do. I mean, we're banged up pretty good. We're banged up going in. I think we're more banged up now, but. We'll be we'll be ready Friday night for a good game.